George Mekon. George Mekon, whose full name is George Lawrence Mekon Jr., born June 18, 1924, and died June 1, 2005, nicknamed Mr. Basketball, was an American professional basketball player for the Chicago American Gears of the National Basketball League, NBL, and the Minneapolis Lakers of the NBL, the Basketball Association of America, BAA, and the National Basketball Association, NBA. Invariably playing with thick, round spectacles, the 6 feet 10 inches, 245 pounds Mekon was one of the pioneers of professional basketball. Through his size and play, he redefined basketball as a game dominated in his day by big men. His prolific rebounding, shot blocking, and ability to shoot over smaller defenders with his ambidextrous hook shot all helped to change the game. He also utilized the underhanded free-throw shooting technique long before Rick Barry made it his signature shot. Mekon had a highly successful playing career, winning seven NBL, BAA, and NBA championships in nine seasons, an NBA All-Star Game MVP trophy, and three scoring titles. He played in the first four NBA All-Star Games and was a member of the first six All-BAA and All-NBA teams. After his playing career, Mekon became one of the founders of the American Basketball Association, ABA, serving as commissioner of the league. He was instrumental in forming the NBA's Minnesota Timberwolves expansion team. In his later years, Mekon was involved in a long-standing legal battle against the NBA to increase the meager pensions of players who had retired before the league became lucrative. For his accomplishments, Mekon was inducted into the Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame in 1959. He was also named to the 25th, 35th, 50th, and 75th NBA anniversary teams. Net Worth George Mekon had an estimated net worth of $1 million. He had gained these impressive amounts from his career in the NBA and from his anonymous investments in his businesses. The NBA legend in his beautiful condo in Scottsdale, Arizona. Early life. Mekon was born on June 18, 1924, in Joliet, Illinois, to a Croatian father, Joseph, and a Lithuanian mother, Minnie, along with brothers Joe and Ed and sister Marie. His grandfather, Uri Mekon, was born in Vivodina, Croatia, then part of Austria-Hungary, in or about 1874. Uri emigrated to Braddock, Pennsylvania, in 1891, where he married another Croatian immigrant, Maria, in 1906 in Allegheny, Pennsylvania. On October 17, 1907, Mekon's father Joseph was born, and soon thereafter the family moved to Joliet, where they opened Mekon's tavern at the corner of Elsie Avenue and North Broadway. As a boy, Mekon shattered one of his knees so badly that he was kept in bed for a year and a half. In 1938, Mekon attended the Archbishop Quigley Preparatory Seminary in Chicago and originally wanted to be a Catholic priest, but later moved back home to finish at Joliet Catholic. Mekon did not seem destined to become an athlete, cause of George Mekon's death. In his later years, Mekon developed diabetes and failing kidneys. Eventually, his right leg was amputated below the knee due to his illness. When his medical insurance was cut off, Mekon found himself in severe financial difficulties. In 2005, however, his condition worsened. Mekon died in Scottsdale, Arizona, on June 1, 2005, of complications from diabetes and other ailments. His son Terry reported that his father had undergone dialysis three times a week for four hours at a time during the last five years of his life. Mekon's death was widely mourned by the basketball world. His plight also brought media attention to the financial struggles of several earlier NBA players. Personal life. In 1947, Mekon married his wife, Patricia, and they remained together for 58 years until his death. The Mekons had six children, sons Larry, Terry, Patrick, and Michael, and daughters Tricia and Maureen. All his life, Mekon was universally seen as the prototypical gentle giant, tough and relentless on the court, but friendly and amicable in private life. He was also the older brother of Ed Mekon, who played basketball for DePaul, played in the BAA, and played for the Philadelphia Warriors of the NBA. Mekon is lauded as the pioneer of the modern age of basketball. Collegiate career. While in high school, Mekon met 28-year-old rookie DePaul basketball coach Ray Meyer. Meyer saw potential in Mekon, who was bright and intelligent but was also clumsy and shy. 
His workout routine would become later known as the Mekon Drill. In addition, Meyer made Mekon punch a speed bag, take dancing lessons, and jump rope to make him a complete athlete. Mekon dominated his peers from the start of his National Collegiate Athletic Association NCAA, career at DePaul. He intimidated opponents with his size and strength and was unstoppable on offense with his hook shot. Mekon established a reputation as one of the hardest and grittiest players in the league, often playing through injuries and punishing opposing centers with hard fouls. Mekon was named the Helms NCAA College Player of the Year in 1944 and 1945 and was an All-American basketball player three times. Professional Career After the end of the 1945-46 college season, Mekon signed with the Chicago American Gears of the National Basketball League, a predecessor of the modern NBA. He played with the Gears for 25 games at the end of the 1946-47 NBL season, scoring 16.5 points per game as a rookie. Mekon led the Gears to a third-place finish at the 1946 World Professional Basketball Tournament, where he was named Most Valuable Player after scoring 100 points in five games. Mekon was also chosen for the All-NBL team. Before the start of the 1947-48 NBL season, Gears owner Maurice White pulled the team out of the league. However, the league folded after just a month, and the players of White's teams were equally distributed among the 11 remaining NBL franchises. Mekon became a member of the Minneapolis Lakers. In his first season with the Lakers, Mekon led the league in scoring with 1,195 points, becoming the only NBL player to score more than 1,000 points in an NBL season. Following the regular season, he was named the league's MVP and the Lakers won the NBL title. In April 1948, he led the Lakers to victory in the World Professional Basketball Tournament, where he was named MVP after scoring a tournament record 40 points against the New York Renaissance in the title-clinching game. Mekon again was dominant, averaging 27.4 points per game and 2.9 assists per game and taking another scoring title, after posting an impressive 51-17 record and storming through the playoffs. Mekon's team played the 1950 NBA Finals against the Syracuse Nationals. In the 1950-51 NBA season, Mekon was dominant again, scoring a career-best 28.4 points per game in the regular season. He won another scoring crown and averaged 3.1 assists per game. He still pulled down 13.5 rebounds per game and logged 3.0 assists per game. Mekon also had a truly dominating game that season. On January 20, 1952, he scored a personal best 61 points in a 91-81 double overtime victory against the Rochester Royals. Mekon's output more than doubled that of his teammates, who combined for 30 points. He also grabbed 36 rebounds, a record at the time. At the end of the 1953-54 season, Mekon announced his retirement. He later said, I had a family growing, and I decided to be with them. I felt it was time to get started with the professional world outside of basketball. Injuries also were a factor, as Mekon had sustained 10 broken bones and 16 stitches in his career and often played through these injuries. And with that, Thanks for watching. Give us a like, share with friends, and please subscribe.